I do not recall. What up loves, it's Naturally Be Nikki and welcome back to my channel. Now that you're here, be sure to like, comment, share, subscribe. All right, most definitely subscribe. We almost at 5K. Show your girl some love. All right, now let's get into it. Zoe's still out here making me angry. She opens up the episode acting like she didn't realize she could get expelled for cheating. Girl, we figured that out the first day of class. Where, where was you at? <laughs> where was you at? Okay, because you must not have got the memo. <laughs> okay, they say that real loud and clear when you get to college. All right, come on, sis. Stop acting like you ain't know. Stop it, Zoe. Stop it. Then Zoe meets with the school board and ends up telling the truth. Girl! What happened to I do not recall? What happened? What happened, sis? Three words. That's all you had to say. You go, I cheated. Girl, you, what you doing? What you doing? Sis is on academic probation, but she is still a Cal U student. Come on. <laughs> yes. Glad to see that Zoe prevailed and she is living to see another day. But sis actually may not, okay? Because her parents decided to pull up on her, all right? Pops and Dre, they decided to pull up on her for parent weekend. And um, Dre said he cut Zoe off. I don't know how sis is about to pay for this college tuition. Y'all know, y'all know how much money we talking. Y'all know how much money we talking. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how this is going to go for Zoe. It's just it's just one stressful situation after another. And to top it all off, Erin catches Zoe at the end of the episode thinking that Anna then finally spilled the tea that she's dealing with Erin and she hasn't. Okay, so Erin ends up spilling the beans to Zoe that him and Anna are a thing. That's exactly what Anna get, okay? You don't get no cool points for what you tried to do. You get points for what you did and since you didn't tell her. You had all season to tell Zoe that you and Aaron were a thing. But you had to make it so much bigger than what it needed to be. And now you in a, you in a pot of hot boiling water because you ain't make no moves, sis. That's something as a friend that should have came out show mouth your mouth Anna and it didn't so now y'all got a problem honestly honestly says I don't know how Zoe and Anna's friendship is gonna look next season I really don't know what that's gonna look like but honestly Anna whatever energy Zoe gives you next season you deserve it sis you deserve it at this point you deserve it okay because you didn't tell her you didn't make no moves and that's just not what friends do the moment, the moment, I keep saying this, I done said it all season. The moment you realize you have feelings for Aaron, it should have been said. So look out here me and Zoe's dad in his kimono and his drawers. Where we do that at? Where? Oh my God, in a whole kimono and drawers. Let, let that happen to me. Let that happen to me. I wouldn't even live to tell the story. I wouldn't be able to talk to y'all no more because I wouldn't be here. <laughs> I wouldn't be here. Um, y'all, Professor Houston done pulled the okie doke on Nomi. Wow. I told y'all, I told y'all last review, I saw that getting messier before I saw it getting better. And I knew she had a shorty up in there. I knew Professor Houston had a shorty up in there when Nomi pulled up on her. I knew she did. I don't know, man. It's just crazy out in these streets. I, I, I just... I feel bad for Nomi. I mean, she she legit came out to her parents for this woman. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, Phyllis was running deep for Shorty. And it just obviously didn't work out. I mean, Nomi, you know, we, we went from prayers up for Zoe. Now we got to do prayers up for Nomi because that, that, that hurt me. That hurt me. But in the end, I am really happy to see that Nomi finally came out to her parents. She's living her truth. She's living her life. You know, I'm here for that. I'm here for that. I'm just sad that it had to, to leave off on that note. Real MVP tonight definitely goes to Jazz's dad. <laughs>
Y'all mean to tell me that this man hacked her IG account, deleted all her pics, and replaced it with some advertisement for his, for his restaurant? <laughs> I guess it looks like Doug and Jazz may be back on next season. And I'd be lying if I said I wasn't here for it, okay? <laughs> Honestly, y'all, I still can't get over the fact that we're already at the spring season finale. Like, where did the time go? Oh my God, I feel like we was just getting started. What happened? Now the real question is, what do y'all want to see me review next, okay? Let me know what new show y'all want to see me review in the comments below, okay, man? Because y'all know I got to review some, so lay it on me, okay? For all my day ones that have been supporting uh, me and my grownish reviews, please know I appreciate you guys. I love you guys to death, and we're going to be back rocking soon, okay? You already know, but before I go, I'm curious to hear from you guys. Who do you think had the biggest bloop tonight, okay? Who and why? Let me know in the comments below. Let's keep the conversation going. And I'll see y'all next video.